and welcome to our another class of our topic transformation of sentences in our previous topic we discuss or read rules about our sentences and in this we will read about the transformation of complex sentences into compound sentences and we have already read the definition of sim this complex sentence and compound sentence in our previous topic that a complex sentence is characterized by one independent clause and at least one dependent clause on the other hand a compound sentence is characterized by at least two independent clauses which can be used as separate sentences and are connected with coordinating conjunctions and we have clearly understood by the sentence that we read in the previous topic so let us step ahead with the rules of transformation of complex sentences into compound sentences first rule if the complex sentence has though although in the beginning though or although in the beginning the compound sentence will follow but or yet but or yet we will follow to connect the different clauses listen carefully if the complex sentence our first rule tells us that if the complex sentence has though or although in the beginning the compound sentence will follow the conjunction but or yet to connect the different clauses example though he is poor he is happy he is poor but he is happy although she is ill she worked very hard she is ill yet she worked very hard so a complex sentence having though or although in the beginning while transforming complex sentence while transforming it the complex sentence into compound sentence we will use but or yet so in complex sentence it is though here in this sentence although then we will use but or yet let us see the example though he is poor he is happy he is poor but he is happy although she is ill she worked very hard she is ill yet she worked very hard so with these examples you can easily understand that the complex and complex sentence that is have that are having though or although in the beginning while transforming them into compound sentences we will use but or yet so and remove though and although though he is poor he is happy he is poor but he is happy so we will remove though and although and we will put here but or yet and rest sentence will be as it is so though he is poor he is happy he is poor but he is happy although she is ill she worked very hard she is ill yet she worked very hard if the complex sentence has lest if the complex sentence has lest and should so lest in the middle having should after the person lest in the middle and should after the person listen carefully if the complex sentence is having lest and should and lest is in the middle of having lest in the middle of having the should after the person means lest before the person and should after the person the compound sentence will use the conjunction or otherwise to connect the different clauses and future tense will be used in the next in the second clause listen carefully if 
द कॉम्प्लेक्स सेंटेंस इज हैविंग लेस्ट बिफोर द पर्सन एंड शुड आफ्टर द पर्सन देन कन्वर्टिंग दैम टू कंपाउंड सेंटेंस वी विल यूज और और अदरवाइज एंड फ्यूचर टेंस विल बी यूज एंड रेस्ट पार्ट विल बी एज इट इज सो लेट एस सी विद एग्जाम्पल स्टडी हार्ड लेस्ट यू शूड फेल स्टडी हार्ड और यू विल फेल प्रैक्टिस हार्ड प्रैक्टिस हार्ड लेस्ट यू शुड बी आउट ऑफ द गेम प्रैक्टिस हार्ड लेस्ट यू शुड बी आउट ऑफ द गेम प्रैक्टिस हार्ड अदरवाइज यू विल बी आउट ऑफ द गेम सो हेयर लिसन स्टडी हार्ड लेस्ट यू शुड फेल स्टडी हार्ड और यू विल फेल प्रैक्टिस हार्ड लेस्ट यू शुड बी आउट ऑफ द गेम प्रैक्टिस हार्ड अदरवाइज यू विल बी आउट ऑफ द गेम सो आर सेकेंड रूल टेल्स अस दैट द कॉम्प्लेक्स सेंटेंस हैविंग लेस्ट एंड शुड वाई ट्रांसफॉर्मिंग दिस वी विल ट्रांसफॉर्मिंग दिस कम कॉम्प्लेक्स सेंटेंस इन टू कंपाउंड वी विल यूज और और अदरवाइज प्लस फ्यूचर टेंस इन द सेकेंड क्लॉज फॉर टू कनेक्ट द डिफरेंट क्लॉजेज वी विल यूज और और अदरवाइज एंड we will use future tense in the second clause so examples are here so in next rule in third rule if the if the complex sentence if the complex sentence has as soon as in the beginning as soon as in the beginning the compound sentence will use conjunction and to join the different clauses if the complex sentence has as soon as in the beginning the compound sentence will use conjunction and to join the different clauses let us see example as soon as the rain stopped we started the journey as soon as the rain stopped we started the journey the rain stopped and we started the journey so here if the complex sentence has as soon as as soon as in the beginning then the compound sentence will use conjunction and and the rest part will be as it is so let us see as soon as the rain stopped we started the journey the rain stopped and we started the journey next example as soon as the baby saw her mother she started shouting the baby saw her mother and started shouting so here with these examples you can un clearly understand the rule that if the complex sentence is having as soon as in the beginning then while transforming it into compound sentence we will use the conjunction and and rest part will be as it is so as soon as the baby saw her mother she started shouting the baby saw her mother and started shouting let us see what our fourth rule tells us in our fourth rule we will see that if the complex sentence if the complex sentence in our fourth rule if the complex sentence is having since as or when in the beginning since as or when in the beginning then the compound sentence will use and so hence therefore to connect the clauses so let us see as he was ill he did not attend the meeting he was ill so he did not attend the meeting so if the complex sentence is having as since or when in the beginning then the compound sentence will use so hence therefore and to connect these two clauses and after that conjunction that we use that since hence though sorry therefore and though uh, and 
the rest part of the sentence will be as it is. Let us see the next example. When it is evening, the sun has set to the west. When it is evening, the sun has set to the west. The sun has set to the west and therefore it is evening. The sun has set to the west and therefore it is evening. So our fourth rule tells us that if the complex sentence has as or when or since in the beginning then the compound sentence will follow and as, so hence or therefore to connect the two clauses, the different clauses. So here are the examples that will clear about the our fourth rule. So our next rule is if the compound if the complex sentence if the complex sentence has if the complex sentence has who listen carefully if the complex sentence has who then the compound sentence will use and in that place and object of the first clause will be the subject of the second clause listen carefully if the complex sentence has who who then the compound sentence will use and in place of who and the object of first, object of first person, first clause will be the subject of the second clause. Let us see. I saw a man who was shouting. I saw a man and he was shouting. I have a friend who is a poet. I have a friend and he is a poet. So, our fifth rule tells us that if the complex sentence has who, if the complex sentence has who, then the compound sentence will use and in place of who, we will use and in place of who and the object of first clause and the object of first clause will be the subject of second clause. I saw a man who was shouting, I saw a man and he was shouting. I have a friend who is a poet. I have a friend and he is a poet. Our next rule, sixth rule. If the complex sentence starts with if. If the complex sentence starts with if and having a negative meaning. Then the compound sentence will be let plus object form of pronoun plus positive form of subordinate clause plus or or otherwise plus main clause. Listen, if the complex sentence starts with if, if, if the complex sentence starts with if and having a negative meaning, negative form, then the compound sentence will start with let, then object form of the noun, pronoun, then positive form of the subordinate means affirmative, plus or or otherwise, plus main clause, rest part of the sentence. So listen carefully. If the complex sentence starts with if and having a negative meaning, then the compound sentence will start with let plus object form of pronoun plus positive form of subordinate clause positive here negative and here positive form of uh, clause subordinate clause then or or otherwise plus rest part of the sentence or main clause so if I do not meet him I will be unable to talk to him let me meet him otherwise I will be unable to talk to him so here if I do not meet him I will be unable to talk to him let me meet him or I will be unable to talk to him if I do not do rehearsal 
if i do not do rehearsal i will be unable to be in the drama let me do the rehearsal or i will be unable to be in the drama so in our six rule we can see that if the complex sentence is having if in the beginning with a negative form if in the beginning with a negative form then the compound sentence will begin with let plus object form of the pronoun plus positive form of subordinate clause plus or or otherwise plus main clause so if i do not meet him i will be unable to talk to him if i do not do rehearsal i will be unable to be in the drama so these are the complex sentence while transforming them to compound sentence first sentence will be let me meet him otherwise i will be unable to talk to him second compound sentence let me do rehearsal otherwise i will be unable to be in the drama so thoroughly read the rules of this transformation of complex sentences into compound sentences thoroughly that we have discussed in this part first to sixth rule we have discussed next rule we will discuss in our second part first you thoroughly go through the rules carefully and practice yourself have a nice day